With eFlex, we will offer a product opportunity to get independent from those petroleum and also from gas prices finally. E-flex, it means electric and flexibility, how you create this uh, electricity. My name is Frank Weber and I'm responsible globally for the E-flex propulsion system development. The primary goal of the car is to run at least 40 miles on pure electric range. And so the whole electric drive system is designed in a way to allow you full range and full uh, performance uh, for those 40 miles. The E-Flex propulsion system is a, an electric drive system. It is not a hybrid, it is an electric drive unit that is able to propel the front wheels and it is using a small engine generator set just to um, charge the battery that is in the vehicle. The Vault show car that we showed in Detroit was a very compact, very, very sporty execution of that, of that E-Flex theme. Flextreme is now focused on getting this versatility aspect that is important for the Opel brand to bring this to the E-Flex architecture. I think it is important to have different perspectives from different people in different uh, countries. We have, I would guess, 200 dedicated engineers that work on eFlex. There is a lot of learning from the EV1 project. What the EV1 was providing is a first glance at electric vehicle technology and was also paving the way towards fuel cells, which was really important. What I always enjoyed about old vehicles is you see how things started and you look at the simplicity of technology and how it evolves over time. You have to be rebellious with eFlex because eFlex will change the paradigms we all have. With eFlex where you actually have kilowatts instead of horsepower and you are working with electric propulsion and electric energy, this is a big, big change. eFlex is now a game changer technology that might influence a whole nother generation of vehicles for the next coming years. When the cover comes off the car in Bockenheim Depot, it's one of those nerve-wracking moments. 